Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. How many times you watched that thing? Guess you really miss her. Don't worry, we're almost there. You'll be able to look her up once we're on board. Sounds like you do have a lot of catching up to do. All right, everyone, we're here. It's sinking our orbit now. All this trouble over that chunk of rock. Deep space mining is a lucrative business, Miss Daniels. Each is seven is a gold mine, according to prospectors reports. Cobalt, silicon, osmium, now, where is she? There she is. We have visual contact. So that's Ishimura. Impressive. The USG Ishimura. Biggest planet cracker in her class. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it all dark? I don't see any running lights. Corporal, take us in closer and hail them. And stay clear of that debris field. We're here to fix their ship, not the other way around. USG Ishimura, this is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kellyan responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. You're gonna need to boost the signal if their power's low. Yes, we know. Boost the signal. More. Never heard of a total communications blackout on one of these things. You'd think with a thousand people on board, someone would pick up the phone. <laughs> What is that? It's a busted array like we thought. Sounds like they're having problems with their encoder. You get us down there and Isaac and I can fix it. 48 hours max. All right, you have the lady. Take us in, let's see what needs fixing. Gravity tethers engaged. Automatic docking procedures a go. What the hell? Sir, the auto dock. What is it? We're off track, we're gonna hit the hole. Hit the blast shields. That guidance tethers damaged. Switch to manual, now. Inside the magnetic field? Are you insane? Abort! No! We can make it inside. Corporal, gave you an order. The field's too strong! Is everyone okay? What the hell were you thinking? Were you trying to get us killed? I just 
saved our asses, Miss Daniels. If we had aborted at that speed and distance, we'd have smashed right into the side of the Ishimura. Now settle down, let's get to work. Corporal, report. I'm not getting any readings from the port booster, and we've lost comms and autopilot. It'll take some time to fix. All right, let's get some extra hands from Flight Deck to help out. Hold still, Isaac. I'm syncing up everyone's rig with the ship. Okay, we're done. Clean bill of health for everyone. All right. We've still got a job to do. We're moving out. You didn't lose power to the port booster. You lost the port booster. Unbelievable. Guess the power's down everywhere. Isaac, get over here and hack the door pad. Seems like everyone was trying to pack in a hurry. There should be a security detail in here. Yeah? Well, there's not. There's nobody here. I can't pick up any broadcasts. But that security console's still live. Isaac, log in and see what you can find. Kendra, get that out of here. I can't! Then we root the damn power! Look, if we all cooperate, we can figure this out a lot sooner. Let's get that computer display up, Isaac. Huh, that doesn't look good. She's taking a lot of damage. The tram system's offline. Getting around's gonna be difficult. The air seems to be flowing again. That's a start. What the hell was that? Automatic quarantine must have tripped when the filtration system restarted. Everybody relax. What was that? Did you... Not sure. What the hell? I don't know. Something's in the room with us. Jesus! Overfire! Overfire! Send up power! Send up! Come on. of them on the way over here. Are you okay? More what? What the hell are those things? Is that the crew? Keep your voice down. Whatever they are, they're not friendly, and half the doors on this ship are locked because of the quarantine. Now, we have to get to the bridge. But first, we gotta repair the tram system. You're crazy, Hammond. You're gonna get us all killed. If you listen to me, I will get you out of here alive. Now, what's wrong with the tram? The data board is fried, but there should be a spare in the maintenance bay. There's also a broken tram blocking the tunnel that needs to be repaired. Damn it! Everything is on the other side of this quarantine. We can't reach it from here. No, we can't. But you can. Isaac, if I can get to the bridge, I should be able to access the personnel files. You fix the tram, and I'll help you find Nicole. Looks like that door is malfunctioning, Isaac. Try using the stasis module you just picked up. Your stasis module should be able to help you with that arm mechanism. Isaac, you did it. The tram is blocking the whole system. When you get the computer online, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. I can hear something crawling around out there. Tram replacement. 
assessment complete. Isaac, I've patched into the deck security system. It took some work, but I've got the door to the maintenance bay unlocked. The data board should be somewhere inside. That's it, Isaac. Take the board back to the tram control and slot it into the computer array. That ticket to the tram can come back online. All right, we're on board and heading to the bridge. Good work. Strange. The quarantine just lifted. Whatever was in the flight lounge must have left. That's lucky for us. Isaac, get back to the Kellyon and prep it for launch. We'll find out what we can from the bridge and meet you there. If we live that long, you're out of your league, Hammond. This is suicide. We're going your to die out here. Your lack of confidence in me is duly noted, Miss Daniels. But I have a mission to complete, and that's exactly what I am going to do, with or without you. Do we understand each other? Just get us out of here alive. Isaac, we made it to the bridge. It's a nightmare up here. No survivors. We're going to try to get to the command computer. Wish us luck. What the hell is happening down there? What happened to the shuttle? That was our ride home. It's the only way off the ship. Kendra. No, Hammond! This changes everything! Just let me think. Can you access the command computer? It's no good. There's an executive lockdown of all primary systems. Without the captain's authorization, I can't access them. Well, where's the captain? Here he is. Captain Benjamin Mathias. Location? Med lab. Status? Deceased. What? How? I can't access that information. Find the captain and you'll find his rig. With his authorization codes, I can crack this computer wide open. Damn it. Isaac, I'm sending the tram back to your location. Get to the medical deck and find that rig as fast as you can. What was that? attacked. Kendra's gone. One minute she was there, and I, I can't believe I lost her. We can still do this. Get me the captain's rig codes, and we'll find Nicole. Looks like the crew barricaded the door to the emergency wing. We'll have to blow through it to get to the morgue. Get some thermite from medical storage, and a shock pad from zero-g therapy. Should be down the corridor. <laughs> Communication is useless in all this static. Thermite you picked up should be able to melt through the barricade. Use the shock pad to ignite it. Hope I can hold this position. I can hear something big moving out there. As you know, the Ishimura is able to set his gravity locally. Your grav boost will kick in when you enter a zero-g area. Great. You got a shock pad. 
Combine that with the thermites at the barricade and destroy it. Shit. I can hear more coming. Moving through the vents. Stay safe, Isaac. Okay, you're through. Should be clear from there to the morgue. Remember, the codes are on the captain's body. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship-wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get him to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. And record him. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Accessing the captain's records right now. Head to the tram station and I'll contact you there. I'm going to find out what the hell happened to this ship. Isaac! Somehow one of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. You've got two problems, and we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engines. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit.
Contamination sequence complete. Thank you for your patience. Centrifuge activated. Re-establishing balance with planetary cargo. Gravity restored. Entering vacuum. You're doing great, Isaac. Centrifuge and gyros are both 100% and stabilized. Now get out of there and focus on the engine. I don't know how much time we have left. Me, I ran for it, and Hammond just... He just disappeared. Kendra? Where are you? Nice to see you're alive and well, Hammond. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them moving outside, but... I don't think they know I'm in here. I can log into everything from here. I hacked the route and found some reports from the colony. Even before they cracked the planet, the colonists were experiencing widespread dementia. It seems to be related to some artifact they found on the planet. Something called the Marker. I'll keep looking. I've got your location and I'm going to unlock the door to fuel storage. You can get to the engine chamber from there. working. We're online and functional. Finally, some good news. Get a tram to the bridge, Isaac. I'm going to take us back into a geostation. Wait, wait, we're not safe yet. The ship's asteroid defense system is offline. On the way up, the ship's going to pass through a debris field thrown up from the planet crack. We'll be ripped to pieces unless you restart us. God damn it. I'll start working on it from here. Isaac, meet me at the bridge. You can do more good here than I can. Where are you? It's me, Nicole. Isaac, come in. Kendra's right. The ADS is completely shot. I'll need your help to fix this. Kendra, if you can hear me, see if you can get to the ship's reports. It sounds like you have better access from there. When were you going to tell us about the artifact, Hammond? This marker? I don't know anything about that. It's referenced in the captain's records. They brought it up from the planet. It's on the ship? In cargo. They think it's of alien origin, but I don't know what the hell it is. Really? CEC didn't know anything about it. You're lying. Back off! I am not the bad guy here. We're all shaky right now. You're gonna have to trust that I don't know anything about it. We've entered the debris field. Get to the captain's nest. I'll explain everything later. Hammer down. Right at your 
feet. I'm reading heavy damage, but containment looks solid. Life support is stabilized. We've got to get the ADS working. Isaac. Dad, you scared me. The place is making me jumpy. Fucking asteroids coming through the roof. Look, I know Kendra doesn't trust me, but I don't know anything about a marker or anything else. This is supposed to be a repair mission. Plain and simple. This mess is the asteroid defense system. I can fix these boards, but the main power routing is shot. You're gonna have to reroute them manually through at least three junction boxes to activate the primary cannon. Oh, but first, you need to activate the atrium elevators from bridge security. You can use them to get to the junction boxes. By the way, Isaac, be careful. I saw something out there, I don't know what. I only got a glimpse. It was big, really big. Shit, stand back. Oh, that one was dead when I sealed the pod. These things don't die easily. for mutiny. Kind, make them listen to reason. Settle down, man. Hold him. By maritime law, Article 5469, I hereby declare Captain Benjamin Matthias unfit for duty. The marker must be delivered to the church. Terence, please. I'm sorry, Ben, but I can't let you do this. Traitor. Heretic! Hold his head. Murderer! Hold him! He's dead. No, it was an accident. I, I had to stop him. Arrest the doctor. It looks like some of the gravity plating is malfunctioning. Keep an eye out for any kind of distortion effect coming from the floor. It could be dangerous. Power transfer to the ADS. Ship systems, junction box rerouted. I'm making some progress with the tracking grid. One of the cannons is giving me a hard time. Keep moving. Isaac, listen up. I've gone over the MedSci reports. These things are biorecombinators. They take dead tissue, absorb it, and mold it into new forms. One iteration seems to have the sole purpose of infecting corpses. The others, well, seem to be making corpses to infect. And that body tissue we keep seeing on the walls is part of it too. I found a report that says it's a habitat changer. Asteroid defense system now online. All right, we've got enough power, but the ADS cannon's order targeting is down. I think it's a faulty data cable. I need you to aim the cannon manually until I can replace it. Take the elevator to the top of the ship and head for the cannon pit. Isaac, you're going to have to cross the ship exterior to reach the ADS cannon. Problem is, we're still getting bombarded by asteroids. Look for cover, or you'll get torn to pieces. That's it, Isaac. You're in the pit. The cannon's a mass driver, so it should punch through anything flying at us. Keep an eye on the hull's integrity. Too many of those things get by, and we're dead. At 
think I've almost got the system prepared. Just buy me a little more time. Just one more minute, and it should be fully operational. I've almost got this thing fixed. Just a little bit longer. Nice shooting, Isaac. Auto-targeting is now online and clearing a path to safe orbit. As soon as we're clear, I'll engage the autopilot again. Head to the tram station, and I'll meet you there when I'm done. Wait! Isaac Hammond, you're not gonna believe this. Oxygen levels are falling. Something's poisoning hydroponics air production, and whatever it is, it's filling the deck up with that organic stuff. We're not gonna have any air to breathe soon. But if I understand these lab reports correctly, I think I can make a poison to destroy it. Head to medical. It should have everything you need. Will this never end? Isaac, get to medical and mix together whatever Kendra's come up with. I'm heading to hydroponics. If I can slow it down, that might keep us breathing long enough to fight it. Oh, shit. Isaac, I can smell the contaminated air from here. It's spreading faster than I expected. I'm trying to isolate it, but it's not going to buy us much time. We have to get that thing off this ship. The chemicals you need are in the chemistry lab. I'll hack the door for you when you get there. You can't stand in the way of God's plan. The natural order. Are you... Are you blind left to rest? Looks like someone has reprogrammed the door locks on this deck. And recently, too. I guess we're not alone here after all. Someone doesn't want you in this part of the ship. You're close to the chemistry station. Once you get the chemicals, you're also going to need a DNA sample of the alien tissue. I'll search the records for one. Please stand by. Antigen compound completed. Please remove the capsule. Your fight for a survival is admirable, but pointless. Uh, and yet you keep on going. It almost makes me think that we had hope as a species. And we're the only one who sees that we have died out a long time ago. We just haven't accepted it yet. Stop running. Stop your struggle. Our future. Your future, the future of our race, ends here. Allow me to introduce you to humanity's child, the children that will replace us, our greatest creation. doing intensive research on it. I've been trying to contact Hammond, but all I'm getting is static. Isaac, you've got to hurry. Your persistence surprises me. Holding on to your final breath, you claw your way along. You hold on to what was once your war. But now, most of the children. Be glad of the knowledge that your death will bring their birth. Listen. Can you hear it? It's coming. Say your prayers. Someone keeps shutting down the door protocol. I bypass the lock. Go! <laughs> That's it, Isaac. Now you just need to... This has gone far enough. 
Accept your part in the God's plan. Embrace your own extinction. Life support system failure on med. What the hell was that? He's Isaac, he's decompressed the entire deck, and I'm being locked out of those systems. All the air has been vented into space. You should be able to bring it back online from the security station, but you don't have much time. You've got everything you need to make the poison. Now get back to the chemistry lab. What are you going to do? Do it fast. Can I be breathing? You're cutting out, Hammond. I'm going to try to switch over. Oh, shit. I lost the signal. I'll continue scanning for his location. You have to get that compound mixed. I've got more intel on the atmosphere. A survivor's report says a massive creature entered the hydroponic deck from outside the ship. That's when the air quality began degrading. The survivor called it the Leviathan. Processing request. Please stand by. Final mixing complete. Please remove the capsule. Let's hope that poison works. Head back to the tram station and get up to hydroponics as fast as you can. Still no response from Hammond, so be careful. There's no telling how contaminated that deck is. I'm beginning to truly admire your spirit, misplaced as it may be. I think... I think you should see the whole plan. You should not spurn the hive mind's offerings. You deserve to witness that at least. will continue. I, Dr. Charles, shall serve as the catalyst to the salvation of our species. These specimens will return to Earth with me. I will spread their divine glory across the entire planet. I will leave you with my creation. Embrace the inevitable. That's the last we see of that thing. I've managed to override Mercer's lockdown. There's a secondary tram station nearby and you can take it to hydroponics. Let's just hope there's enough time. Isaac. Good to see you in one piece. Don't take your helmet off. The head's rotten. I gotta look at it. It's huge. You won't believe it. Shut itself in food storage. Crew that was on this deck. I think they're what's poisoning the air. They've been transformed. I saw one of them. Bloated. Swollen. They're like poison factories. We need to take them out where we can still breathe. <clears throat> Hammond! I thought you were dead. You need to get to cleaner air. You're not going to be able to help Isaac in your condition. <coughs> Isaac, I'm scanning the area now. He's right, there's something really big in food storage. But I can't get a good scan. <coughs> Monitor readings are off the scale. Be careful. That's the door to food storage. But I can't override the integrity lockdown. You have to destroy the pods to bring the air quality up. Then you can go through and use the poison on the Leviathan. I suppose I should be glad that Ham's alive, but I still don't trust him. I think he's hiding something about the marker.
Isaac. There's a switch in atmosphere control to restart the oxygen recycling. Once the air's clean, you can get into food storage. Isaac, I've been reading these reports. The crew all began having mass hallucinations. And... Well, I just saw my brother. On a security monitor. And that's just not possible. Exiting zero gravity. Isaac, where are you? Help me! Flushing all air vents. Restoring nitrogen and oxygen levels. Food storage lockdown lifted. Unknown antigen injected into the filtration system. Damn it. The poison wasn't strong enough. It's still alive. Get in there and kill it before it contaminates the entire ship. Entering zero gravity. No sign of his rig anywhere. It's up to us now. I've got a plan to get off this ship. I've located an SOS beacon on the mining deck. If you can get down there and activate it, we might be able to send a distress call. Oh God. I don't know how much longer that door will hold. This may be our last chance of getting out of here alive, Isaac. There's an asteroid loaded up in the mining bay waiting to be smelted. If you attach the SOS beacon to it, you can launch it away from the ship to make a clean broadcast. The beacon's on the maintenance subdeck. You can launch the asteroid from the control room. <sighs> Damn, the control room is locked. It looks like they keep an emergency access key on the processing subdeck. Couldn't be easy, could it? I don't know how much more of this I can take. Subject is offline for some reason, Isaac. I'll see if I can run a bypass. Entering zero gravity. There's a failsafe on the processing control door. It won't open until gravity is restored. But you can't turn on the gravity until those boulders are cleared from the room. Maybe you can dump them into that gravity beam with your kinesis gun. That's the key, Isaac. It'll get you into the control room so you can launch the asteroid. Don't forget to attach the beacon first. I read another report on the colonist dementia. It seemed to start after they removed the marker from the planet. God knows how long it was down there.
Isaac? Is that really you? It feels like it's been so long. But I can help you now. Come with me. next to you. I think I can disable the lock from here. Hold on. Okay, the door's unlocked, Isaac. I can't get over to you, but I'll find a way. I love you. This will all be over soon. Isaac. Hey, I lost your signal for a while. You had me worried. I see you've got the beacon, so head for the mining bay and attach it to the asteroid. I've been running trajectory calculations, and if we launch soon, there's a good chance the asteroid can reach a safe distance to begin transmitting. Still no sign of Hammond. In his state, I can't imagine he's still alive. I've got elevator access to the mining subdeck. It was a security lockdown, although I don't think it helped them. Now that you've got the beacon and the key, head over there. It looks like the asteroid is held in place by some gravity tethers. You have to knock those out before you can launch it. on its way. All functions normal and broadcasting wideband. Now we just have to hope somebody's listening. I'll position the array receiver. I thought I saw my brother again. He waved to me like nothing was wrong. Okay. I should be able to leave this channel open. What? The comms array receiver isn't responding. Isaac, can you get back to the bridge? We need that array online or we can't receive signals from anyone responding to the beacon. Things are looking up. A military ship just shocked in. The USM Valor. I don't know what it was doing out there. It must have gotten our distress signal. We can't talk to it until the comms array is fixed. I'm gonna hack the door to communications for you. Get in there and find the comms control station. Isaac, the door to communications is open. But I've been getting some weird feedback spikes on the local comms. I think someone's listening in on us, so be careful. Communications array offline. A service technician has been notified. That comms array is in bad shape. We need at least six working dishes for a strong enough signal. Make sure they're aligned symmetrically so there are no power gaps. Communications array realigned. Messages can now be received. That's it. It's working. Get back to communications and use the control panel to send our coordinates to the Valor. This is USM Valor, widecasting on all frequencies to USGE Shimura in response to your SOS. We picked up your escape pod, number 47, and are en route to your position. This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. What? Isn't that the escape pod Hammond Jettison? One of those things was on board. No! No, this is going to happen. USM Valor! Come in, Valor! Your signal isn't strong enough. I'm going to open the blast door to boost the signal. Error. Blast door lockage detected. Please contact a repair technician. Shit! Isaac! There's something big on the hull of the ship, directly above the comms array. Something organic. I don't know what it is, and I don't care. We have to get the doors open to transmit to the Valor. We should have a clear shot from ABS Cannon 48. Get to the cannon and blow it out into space. <laughs> Manual override in 
Ishimura, come in. Do not open the escape pod. USM Valor, this is Kendra Daniels on the USG. Ishimura, come in. Do not open the escape pod. Damn it! Spawn! Why did they open the pod? Damn it. Oh my god. It's headed right for us. Isaac! Isaac! Fuck out of there! <sighs> Wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I <laughs> Isaac! <laughs> Isaac, are you there? Thank God you're all right. I've been trying to reach you. Someone's been blocking my rig signal remotely. <coughs> A crash must have interrupted the signal block. Hammond, where have you been? <coughs> Surviving. Barely. A thousand men supply I haven't cracked myself up. Listen. I'm calling aboard on the mission. Fuck the CEC and fuck the chain of command. We have to get the hell out of here. I think I've located a shuttle on the crew deck. Flight log says it needs a new singularity core, but we can probably salvage one from the Valor. I can see the tail end of it sticking out from the side of the Ishimura. I'm headed down there now to find a way inside. I'll meet you there. Hammond out. Isaac, if what he says is true about the shuttle, we might have a chance of getting out of here. Head to the cargo bay and see if you can help Hammond. In his condition, he may not last long. log for the Valor. I don't think their presence here is a coincidence. They're not on reconnaissance and they're not on patrol. This ship is prepped for war. They're on a seek and destroy mission. Do you hear me? Isaac, I've lost him again. No signal from Hammond's rig. Find the Singularity core and get the hell out of there. Entering zero gravity. Isaac. One of the Valor's weapons ripped open in the crash. Those green orbs you see are highly radioactive, and the Valor's airlock has sealed itself. You're going to have to throw those into space before you can get into the ship. The part you're looking for will be in the engine room at the back of the ship. I'm reading massive damage, so you may need to find an alternate route to get there. The infection process is doing something strange to these soldiers. They all have built-in stasis units in their body armor. The infection is merging the stasis unit into their flesh or something, making them move fast, real fast. Be careful. Isaac. Isaac, I'm tracking your position, but it doesn't look like I can reach you. This damn ship was nearly shared in half. I made it to the bridge. It's a mess here. These poor bastards didn't stand a chance. 
I'm going to override all door locks so you can get to the engine room. I'll try and catch up with you there. <laughs> Mr. Clark, I need to speak with you. My name is Terence Kine, Dr. Kine. Listen to me, there isn't much time. If you really can repair the shuttle, there is a better use for it than just running away. You must understand, the forces at work here are greater than you can imagine. If you leave now, you condemn all humanity. The planet will never stop, never rest, unless the marker is returned. Don't you see? The church is wrong. This is all a trap. I've seen it. Please, you must help me. You got it? Oh my god! You got it! That's the piece we need. Get to the crew deck. Uh, Isaac! Over here! I'm trying to reach my phone with that. You got the singularity call, that's our ticket out of here. Get that call to go! Don't wait for me! Oh, fuck me! the shuttle Hammond found. <sighs> Shit. No good. That shuttle's brain dead. Someone removed the navigation cards. God knows why. There's three of them scattered around the deck. I'm downloading their locations. I can't access the doors from here, so you'll need a crew key. If you can find those parts, I think we can get that shuttle operational again. What do you claim to when all must seem so utterly hopeless around you? That her cross was a true claim. She had faith. And now she awaits her transformation. Her rebirth. Are you ready to ascend the temple? Of course you are. Have no fear. You will play your part soon enough. Witness the conviction of a true believer! They are ready. 
Take him! Embrace them! Mr. Clark, I really must speak with you. I'm very close to your position, and and I know you want to hear what I have to say. I can explain all this. So what happened? When you have the nav cards, I'll let you into the security station. We must talk. Hurry! The life support system in Sleep Lock B has been shut down. You'll have to find an override nearby to get through the door. Responsibility for this tragedy. Now, I must take responsibility for ending it. Atone for my sins. But you can help me. If you repair the shuttle and bring the marker back on board, we can end this forever. <laughs> Engines. 
things right. The shuttle needs to be released before launch. The control platform there. I need you to guide the undocking procedure while I start the shuttle's engines. This will make us whole again. Hurry! I'll take the shuttle up to the flight deck where the marker's being held. I'm en route to the flight deck. Meet me there and we can load the marker on board. Yes, Amelia. Soon we'll take it home. I don't know if Kind is crazy or not, but we need that shuttle. Let's keep him on our side. For now. Your time has come. No need to be frightened. No reason to fight. Many have gone before us. And now it's time for us to take the voyage together. Transcend death. The future take its course. Join me as I gaze upon the face of God. <laughs> Mr. Clark, I'm approaching the shuttle hangar. You must, you must find your way to the cargo bay. The marker, it's being stored in there. There's a cargo loading lift there you can use to deliver the marker up to the hangar. Please, you must help me with this. It's the only way. Stop this hive mind. We can end this nightmare at last. Over here. Hurry. There's no time to waste. We must do it. Wait. Amelia. Where are you going? Sorry, Isaac. I couldn't let him go through with it. I suppose I should thank you for finding the marker. We even managed without help from the USM Valor. Thank you for helping me find him, by the way. My department's been looking for this place for a long time. See what kind didn't know us? It was the government's mess to begin with. This whole planet is one big experiment. The marker? This <laughs> divine relic? Made by man. They reverse engineered it a couple of hundred years ago from the real marker, a true alien artifact recovered on Earth. They dug it up, studied it, and they made it their own. Then they brought it to Aegis 7 and activated it. 
and you've seen the result. The stuff of nightmares. They sealed the system, and no one would have been the wiser. But then the CEC blunders in and starts tearing the planet apart. The experiment was still alive. Kind was right about the hive mind. The marker would contain it, but that doesn't matter now, does it? I have the marker, and this entire system can go to hell. For what it's worth, you did a great job, Isaac. See you around. Or maybe not. Isaac, Nicole, I need you to help me. Help us. Now. I'm... I'm in the flight control room. Please, Isaac, hurry. Please. I love you. Isaac? Is that really you? I never thought we'd be together again. God, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for what I did. I never wanted to hurt you. You need to get it back now, Isaac. You can pilot the shuttle remotely from here. Make us whole again. Make us whole again. Isaac, what the hell are you doing? You're making a big mistake. This is not over. Escape pod away, crew shuttle USG-09. Repeat, shuttle has ejected escape pod. It doesn't matter. She can't escape her fate. None of us can. Here it comes. I'll reprogram the shuttle so we can fly down to the colony. God, we're so close, Isaac. Now go, get on the shuttle. I'll meet you there. You're doing the right thing, Isaac. We're together now. The way it always should have been. I knew you'd come back for me. Nothing can stop us now. Isaac, use one of the loaders to get the marker off the shuttle. Isaac, the marker needs to be returned to the pedestal chamber. Use the loader to bring it there and place it on the pedestal. Replace what was taken and make us whole again. Turn to me. We are whole again, Isaac. We are whole. Emergency. Geo-orbital gravity tethers offline. Tectonic load released. Impact. 
Isaac, it's me. I wish I could talk to you. I'm sorry.